When the STEM Research Online Challenge was released, we instantly got to start working. Our main goal being to increase the auto drive accuracy and in order to gain more points. We named this project Nothing is Impossible. First of all, we started with four points. Then that went to 38 points. Then it went to 71 points. Then 102, 103, and now our goal is 140. There are many sensors in the VEX IQ program, but we chose three to put in our auto drive. We chose the touch LED, the color sensor, and the gyro. The gyro and the color sensor are the main two sensors for this robot. The color sensor detects where the robot is on the field by measuring the black lines. The gyro is to detect that direction. With this robot, in the same machine, same program, same field, we got this different outcome. It sometimes succeed and sometimes fail. So we use a lot of coding algorithms to make sure we get the right accurate turn to push in the rises. When we faced many failures and our auto drive not working, we decided to go to the University of Technology, Sydney, to ask for their help. They welcomed us into their artificial intelligence lab and we experienced the most advanced robotic arm that we've ever seen. They used many accurate sensors to connect the body with the robot. After that, they explained to us what PID was and PID stands for proportional integration derivative and PID control is one of the most used control so when we got back we used the information as inspiration for our sensors and auto drive. In our recent national wide tournament our auto drive scored and 103 and we were very proud of that. Now we are looking forward of achieving 140 for our next auto drive. Having been interested in sensors, we made up and programmed a game, Knots and Crosses, using nine touch LEDs. So this is a bumper switch. These are two bumper switches and this stands for a new round. This is a new game. Okay, so if we go on there, the noughts goes first and we tap one of the nine touch LEDs, for example. And then the next player, they can either un they can tap any of the other eight touch LEDs. So we could go like there. And we keep playing this. This is a win. They record the score on the screen saying noughts, how much the noughts have won, how much the crosses have won, and then we retry again.